Hello guys, this is Tuck Sokos here, chilling out in bed on a Saturday morning. Today being a Saturday, it's market day here in Georgetown. And very soon, I'll be jumping out of bed to go to the market. Okay guys, I am now out of bed ready to go to the market i'll just take a walk to the market since it's not far from where i live so come along with me guys <laughs> Georgetown. See? This is the main street in Georgetown. The open farmer's market in Georgetown is held only once a week on Saturdays between June and October. So it's a street market. During the week, this street, the main street, is uh, busy with the uh, traffic and uh, no market activities are held. But uh, come Saturday, this street is totally closed to traffic and uh, the farmers market is you know arranged along the road farmers will be displaying their wares along this street well guys as I said earlier on, uh, today is Saturday and uh, the farmers have already arrived. They have set up camp here on Main Street and business is in progress. The roads have been closed. No traffic is allowed here in Main Street, as you can see. Completely closed. 
it's farmers day today farmers market day here we go can you sing Hallelujah. can someone stand here and sing is there someone here who can help us show us show us the way Blood runs in the street. There's fighting on every corner. Everyone's running from the heat. Can we sing? Hallelujah. Can someone stand here and say, yourself i'm living the dream yes so by the way, how are you doing business wise not too bad but too my bad. booth is right there Which, I'm who I, is this one this is mike he had to use the bathroom though so i'm covering for him ah oh, you are covering I'm for him covering for him yeah, okay hey we gotta help each other out yes which one is yours right there so yeah, what I got, hey i got you covered whatever you want you know he left me with absolutely everything so i'm i'm locked and loaded what can you tell us about uh, the day today oh you know what not as busy as it normally is right it's a little slower obviously because of the rain right uh -huh. it, but you know but look people are still coming they're still turning around and buying you know mike made a bunch of sales sorry mike is the purveyor of this booth yes we've made a bunch of sales already as well too. regardless uh -huh. of the rain you know do when you your think... product's good it'll sell itself yeah do you think do you think one day is good enough for this kind of business do you think you need more days we to exhibit you, here you, you in need downtown? more days yeah you need more days you know one day is one day is okay but that's why we do various other markets right okay. so we're not just we're not just here we're also turning around and doing you know acting he's in milton as well too there see is. there's mike okay <laughs> see hi mike see here you go <laughs> hey i got you covered man i yeah, told I you yeah. you're doing see? Good. You're doing fine <laughs> okay so you you are exhibiting at various other locations that's right so you do milton as well too right? yeah we do milton and guelph milton, milton and, and guelph. guelph and we also do rockwood and acton okay how many days in each of those locations so we we are three days a week right for ourselves you are how many uh, milton saturdays and sundays saturday and sundays yeah yeah but here it's only saturday only saturday only saturday here okay good thank you so much you're very welcome and tell us about your products what kind of products do you have here i'll have the greens microgreens yeah uh -huh. and salads i have okay. a beekeeper we have our honey you have honey there yeah raw okay honey. you keep some bees i do you are a beekeeper a beekeeper yeah so all right so tell us what do you have here what so the name of our company is rodina rodina and that means family in ukrainian so ah. that's why that's why you'll see it's baba's pierogies after my mom it's papa's sausages after her dad right it's buiko sauerkraut after my uncle and it's zia's pizza after her aunt so everything that we do is the stuff that we grew up with Oh, so we're bringing back all of our old traditions you know for everyone to enjoy okay and that's why we also have lollipops for the kids we also mm -hmm. have dog treats for the pooches because it's all family okay hi hello hi there how are you uh, do you mind talking to me about what you are doing here i am spinning yarn 
spinning yarn. Yarn, and this is an electric wheel. And Marguerite, over my left shoulder, is working on a regular standard treadle wheel. So mm -hmm. the power is coming from her feet. This one is coming from a battery. Mm -hmm. And Will, at the back, has got another electric wheel that's bigger. And it's wood. This one is 3D printed. And we're all members of Credit Valley Artisans. And we're the we in the Weavers Guild, Heritage Hand Weavers and Spinners. Okay. And we weave and we spin and we knit and do other fiber activities. Oh, I see. Yeah. And then uh, when when you spin this, what what comes out of that? And we get wool from that. I like so this. there there is some of my yeah, some hand of spun right spinning. there. Oh, this is what comes out of that. Yes. yes. Okay. Okay. Beautiful. Oh, here we are. Good stuff. <laughs> yep, excellent stuff. And the other yeah. things are, items are hand woven by all of us. This yeah. is hand woven or hand knitted. Okay. Oh. This is interesting. Oh. It's fun, eh? Doing yeah, this. Wonderful. Very <laughs> relaxing. Very zen. <laughs> Okay. So these are the products that you yeah. that come out of this. Yes. Okay. Good. Traded Valley at Artisan. Yes. It's a company. What is it? Is no, it no. We just we have a guild. We have volunteers. We're mm -hmm. a guild. We get together. Um, um, an afternoon every week or and once a month we have our official meeting and we spit, sit and spin uh, or weave um, we, uh, pr we are working on a project where we have fleece from several sheep that we're, we're working on cleaning it and, and, and then spinning it and then we're going to have a project of a blanket possibly um, and, when, it's, when and it's done do, do you sell the stuff that you produce at, at markets like this we okay. don't well we do sell but wherever we can and people buy privately from us but mm. we don't have a store but we do have these um, booths that we get at market are, are you volunteers build. are you working as volunteers volunteers yeah okay We're just volunteers and what uh, organization benefits from uh, your well, it's pro uh, personal. It depends. I mean, you, it may be someone. I, I am actually doing some hats to donate that was from yarn that was donated from a lady that passed away. So that's I'm donating those hats from her stash of yarn. Mm -hmm. I'll be donating them at Christmas to different markets and selling those. But um, as far as this goes, these are private sales for our own. To, to, um, accommodate our hobby. Okay. Yes, okay. because it's not an inexpensive hobby, but mm -hmm. it's fun, very relaxing. Yes. And, Good. Yeah. yeah. Good. But the, the, I'm, I'm just trying to set up. This is a little weaving loom uh -huh. um, that makes little squares that you can then um, uh, join together and make things with and. So this is weaving, so spinning, and they're, they're all spinning, yeah. Okay. So, but the Credit Valley Artisans, mm -hmm. it, we have pottery and um, stained glass, um, and um, what else do we have? We have workshops, mm -hmm. yeah. And we have a new website, <coughs> just started yesterday, yeah. which is... Uh, Credit Valley Artisans Halton dot CA. Mm. Yeah, so you can get some more information from there. Okay. And we'll be loading when the courses will be. Like yes. I learned to weave through through the guild. I joined um, mm -hmm. a class and then I joined the guild. And these ladies um, are there all the time as well. Okay. Yeah. Good. Yeah. That's Thank you so yeah. much. Thank you. Thank, Thank you guys. You. Thank you. Yeah, I, I like this one, eh? Hey. <laughs> I'd like I like to think of it as exercise, but I'm not sure that it is exercise. It is exercise, I'll, I'll yeah. It exercise. Yeah, it's exercise. Yeah.
burn some calories. It's got to. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank Have you. a nice You're day. Bye-bye. Well, you produce here. Yes, thank you. Yeah. Nice tomatoes. How much? Are they five dollars? Five dollars. Yeah. Okay. And uh, these are five as well. Yeah. What what is this? So it's a pea pod. So it, on the inside there's like a <laughs> so you open them up. And they have these little peas on the inside. Oh, yeah. okay. So each basket five dollars. Yeah. Okay. And this, what is this? So that is garlic scapes. Garlic. Garlic scapes. So you use it like you would garlic. The way you use garlic. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You make like pesto with it too and different types of things. Uh-huh. And we have some beans, green beans. Yeah. Okay. So where, where is your farm located? Uh, it's just on 8th line, just down the road there, and then we have another one on 15th side road. Okay. I need two canes. Like mid-July. Corn? Yeah, corn's like our big, okay. big seller. Is it, uh, what type of corn? Is it white or uh, ye peaches yellow? Cream, peaches and cream, yeah. It's what? Peaches and cream. I mean the corn. White the corn, yeah, white and yellow. White and yellow. Yeah. Okay. It's delicious. Yeah, I like white because you like the white corn, yeah. From my country we use white. Oh, okay. Yeah, we have white corn. No no yellow. No yellow corn? <laughs> no. It's probably very sweet. Yeah. Like, I would like that. Yeah. yeah, the yellow is sweet. Yeah. But uh, the white is just plain, not no I can't say no taste, but it's not sweet. Okay. Yeah. I'll have to try it one day. The one you produce is it sweet? The white one? Uh, we don't do uh, white. We just do like it's like a mixed, so it's like a multicolor. So it's white and uh, yellow on the same corn cob. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, it's sweet. It's delicious. It's okay. Really good. You'll have to come try it when we have it. Yeah. It's really yeah. Good. Sure. I will. <laughs> you can eat it like without anything on it too, like just. Like when a... when when is it ready? Uh, mid July end of August. Or sorry, mid July end of July. So. Mid-July they'll have corn. Mid and end of July. Yeah. Okay. That's when we'll have like our own because we grow it. So. Yeah. So the market will still be open here. Yeah. Yeah. This market's open till October. Till October. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. I'll pass by. Okay. Sounds good. Take Thank care. you. Here, here we are.
Nice flower beds on Main Street. Can someone stand here and see? Is there someone here who can help us to show us 